All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to One Game, One Life. My name is Typo, and this is The Elder Scrolls IV Oblivion, Part 24. Okay, so it is 2.11 p.m. on Xander's 15th day here in Cyrodiil, and we're about to enter Smoke, Hill Ca Smoke Hole Cave on the way to Anvil, where we're going to be doing more city stuff. We also have Den Dunbar Cove to visit, and uh, yeah, let's do it. We had an imp just outside, so... That might be a hint as to what we're fighting in here. And we can handle imps just fine. Even before we got Brother Martin to help us out here. And Brother Martin has been pretty impressive, if I'm going to be completely honest. Give him his dues. He's probably not the strongest guy around, but uh, at least compared to us, he's pretty good. This is interesting. Not what I expected. Statues and a big bridge. Lit fires. What is the, What is all this? Hello? What do we got here? Uh, conjurers, maybe? Oh my god, my favorite. Better up, better up, let's swing! Oh my god, messed it up again. I'm swinging too late. I'm really disappointed in myself, I'm gonna have you know. Okay. I know we're, we have to go in the light to get behind him, but... Boom, baby! Yeah. Just that easy. Brother Martin, we're making it happen. Though that one was mostly me, he will definitely help in the future. The Brass Tome. Brass Tomb. Ooh. I thought Brother Martin was the back of a statue for a second there. Okay, what do we got? A lot of coffins. I'm thinking undead or vampires. Which I guess would be undead, but you know what I'm saying. Okay. Couldn't sneak up on a ghost facing us. Oh, sorry, rat. I was, looking, I was going for the ghost. He just happened to be in the way. Ooh, getting it happen. Making it happen. Making it happen. Making it happen. Now that, now that we can hand-to-hand -hand ghosts... That's nice. I like that a lot. Easy. Come on. I need to... Need to... Ah! That was close. I almost clicked that way too late. I'm surprised I actually got that one, to be honest. But I'll take it. I'll take it. I ain't complaining. Full health? We're in the middle of a dungeon and we're full health? You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> Usually we slowly lose our health over the course of the dungeon because we can't replace it as fast as we lose it. So it's nice to see it, uh, us actually holding true here. Hmm. We have enough bone meal. Thank you. What is here? Another ghost. I see. Smoke Tomb Outer Key. Whoa. Oh, I hit the wrong button. Okay, here we go. Light him up, light him up. Get that hand to hand up. Smoke him. Nice. Ooh, hello. Stop attacking Brother Martin instead of me. I want to be your target. Until I'm almost dead, then you can choose Brother Martin. Smoke Tomb Outer Key. Oh, shit. That was a very hard lock without it. Sneak increased. Good. Sneaky, sneaky. Are we going to get this? Ooh. Regretful that we didn't get a chance to swing batter batter at him, but... Impressive that we got it. Now the ghost next. Oh... Oh. I have no idea where our sneak skill is, to be honest. I just know we need to work on it. Oh, shit. Damn it, I thought I hit him. I missed. I messed it all up. Did I make a ghost stagger with my hand to hand? Is that something we did? Okay, we need to take the ectoplasm just because it's so much. Oh, a skeleton guardian. You don't say. That's a real opponent. There you go. Oh, dude, we're making it happen, though. Oh, he just, he can't handle the fatigue loss. Look at that. Boom. Boom. Ah, boom. Yeah. All right. Skeleton Guardian, our first uh, decent skeleton opponent, I suppose. I don't even think those existed in Skyrim. Pretty sure just skeletons are skeletons in Skyrim. This must be the end of the dungeon. Did we uh, skip some of the <laughs> some of the rest of it? 
Average chest. Okay. Nice. And? Nice. And? Oh, nice. That went so well. Dispel other. Common soul gem and 129 gold. Yes, sir. Restoration increase. Awesome. Also. One day that will reach 100, but it's a long road away from that. Average. Nice. Oh, I was about to say we're doing so good. I jinxed it in my mind. Cure disease, okay. Okay, smoke tomb cleared. That was cool. We're starting to get to some tougher opponents. Uh, we are starting to get better at combat. That's, that's an obvious. The fact that our hand-to-hand -hand can now hit ghosts, we can knock them over. The fact that our blocking with hand-to-hand -hand actually staggers opponents nowadays, that's also huge. I remember when our hand-to-hand -hand did not do that, and they just swung through it. We were reducing damage, but they just kept swinging. That was nuts. It was, I mean, it was good training when that goblin was swinging at us like mad, but... For the sake of survival, it was not good. Alright, let's go this side. Is there going to be another equivalent on this side? Kind of the same thing? I'd love to see another uh, Skeleton Guardian, guardian some, guarding some good loot. That'd be great. I'd be all about that. These chests are in the weirdest places. Smoke Tomb Inner Key! Oh, let's go. That's a lot of skeletons. That's three skeletons right there. Damn. Okay. Alright. That's so cool. Is that like a jumping puzzle? No. Stay in the dark. Stay in the dark. Ah, I didn't get it. Bang. Okay. Yeah, but when they're standard skeletons, easy kills. Very easy. Okay, so this is not a jumping puzzle or something here. Chest. Brass pearl ring and 16 gold? Okay. Uh, looks like this is as far as this goes, so I guess the last path we have to go search is where the inner key is going to be used. Which makes sense. It's the inner key because it's just a straight up, it's just a straight path. That does make sense. I buy it. And then the outer key was like an extra wing area that we did just for fully exploring it. Alright, let's see what we got here. Put your dukes up. Weak potion of healing. I'll take a look at what all of our skills are uh, next time we get to a... What the hell? There's nothing up here. Uh, like I said, I'll, I'll look at our skills. The... Uh, nice. Almost missed that. The next time we're in a town, like Anvil, or Dunbar Co. Co. Wherever there's like... We're not threatened or trying to move somewhere new. Um, just to let it build up a little bit before we finally try it out. Where is the smoke tomb? Acrobatics increased? Cool, I guess. Uh, where is? Where do we use the inner key? I don't. I don't get it. Was there another door on the other side? I'm not seeing it. Oh, I'm so confused at where this key goes. Let's look at the local map. Okay, okay, mm-hmm, uh-huh, yeah. Is there something over here we missed? No? Something over there? Alright, let's, uh, go back the other way? Hmm. Or is, or do we need to fall off the bridge in the first area? Let me just double check this first. Sorry if I'm wrong, but it just seems weird to me that there wouldn't be a door in this area to use that key on. I'm not seeing a door. Not seeing a door. No? And this went to the outer tomb. Yeah. Double check for a door in here. Is that light showing me to a door? No, that's not a door. No, there's there's uh, there's no door. 
very odd. I guess we are going back to the original area. Huh. Who knew? That's not a door. Okay. Well, let's do it then. I guess we'll train our alteration with the extra magicka we have. I can start doing that. I can start using Ease Burden even when we don't need to use Ease Burden just to train alteration up. Or is that a major skill? Oh, it is. Maybe we don't do that then. I have any anything spammable for our extra points here? Could conjure a bond. Uh, could conjure a bound dagger. Uh. Yeah, it looks like that's about it. But hey, we do need to get our conjuration up. So you know what? Maybe that's not so bad. We'll make that our four. There we go. And then we can just bam bound dagger. Can we put it away after we use it, though? Yeah. That uh, that one spell wouldn't. Conjuration increased. No. Once once a weapon's equipped, it, you're stuck with it. So we need to make sure we're also not getting in a fight soon after. Okay. Inner key, huh? Inner key, huh? Where do you go? Shadow tomb. Inner key. Oh. Did we not see this, really? <laughs> Hello? Smoke Tomb Inner Key. Oh, wow, there's another way right there. Oh, this is just the same. It's just a, one of those U-shaped things. Okay. How did we miss this? God, there's so many things I might have missed in this game. Terrifying. Swing, bada bada, swing! <laughs> Boom, skeleton up! Hello, zombie. A lot of zombies. Come on now. Get the hand to hand going. There we go. There we go. Nice. Hi, right, Brother Martin. Very good. Very good. Okay, so this is the down here area. Alright. So this is just if you fell down the bridge. Gotcha. And then there was another way. This way. This must be where the inner tomb key is. Used. Oh, there's a mud crab. What is with the mud crabs down here? Oh. How did he not see me? <laughs> Yo, zombies are so blind. You've got to be kidding me. That's incredible. Brother Martin, do you see this? He's gonna walk right into us. Dumbass. Dumbass. Boom, boom. Oh, I got pushed into getting hit by Brother Martin, but that's alright. He's not trying to doom me, he's just doing it anyway. For better or worse. 25 gold and ectoplasm. Hey, yo. Easy lock. Oh. Nice. And? Oh, that was it. Ah! There we go. 23 gold, that's worth. It only costs 5 to get more, as long as I don't run out before I can get more. Boot, smoke hole boot tomb. Hmm. I see. We're not even at the point of the inner key yet, that's crazy. The thing is, like, if not for the inner key, I would have never known this area was here. That's the ter That's the scary part. How, have I missed an area in a dungeon before just because I didn't know there was more dungeon? It's very possible. Security skill increased. That's up to 44, I saw that. That's one of our main skills, too. Skellies. Good old skellies. Uh, Brother Martin, I guess we're dropping down here, man. I don't see another option. He probably doesn't like that. Most AIs don't like falling. Well, hello, hello. Let me just go ahead and uh, train my block skill, if you don't mind. Uh, or not. Nice. Okay. Nice. Okay, he's already dead. Okay, skeleton's dealt with. 
26 gold and a lockpick. Nice. We are slowly losing lockpicks at the moment. Mostly because I'm breaking them. Actually, entirely because I'm breaking them. Yeah. Ooh, nice block, kid. I see you. Oh. Boom. And boom. How's our armor doing? Is it still intact? Sometimes we don't notice when they're not intact. It is, though it's not doing great. Don't have enough magicka, what? Alright. Moving forward here. Brother Martin and I, he actually did come down. Pretty impressed. Okay. Nice chest, thank you. Very thoughtful of you to have that for me. Now what is this? A rat? Okay. Oh shit! A rat! Sneaky sneaky! We're getting so good at this! Boop. Booped it on the ass. It's dead. Alright, now we're on the other side of this great little gully. Xander continues his his way through the lands of Cyrodiil having barely seen any of it he's been in a lot of deadly situations he just continues to make it happen anyway boy. 18 gold surprise we're still running into rats we are like level 6 but it could be that this place is just a very low level zone like I said it's Oblivion's only leveled to some like to such an extent where if it's a low level area, it might still just have rats. Skyrim does the same thing, but to a much lesser extent. Okay. And I could be totally wrong about anything I say about Oblivion. Like I said, it's been 15 years, and it's not like I've Googled anything. I prefer I prefer the more blind approach. This game is almost blind. And there's so many skills and stuff I have just like I've never used mysticism in an Elder Scrolls game, period. I've almost never used Illusion. Conjuration, I almost never used. There's a lot of skills I'm looking forward to using that I've just like never used before. And one of the reasons I'm liking Speechcraft is because this is the only game I get to use it. Though sometimes it becomes too much Speechcraft when, it, when we were in the Imperial City for like three parts. Okay, come on, man. Ooh, Brother Martin. I thought he was punching for a second. No, he's using a dagger. <laughs> okay, we did loot that. All right. All right, moving on, moving on. Is this the inner door? No, it's not. We're still, we're still moving. Yo, the dungeons in Oblivion are so big. Wild, wild. Well, what is this? Hello? Ah. Ow. What is that? Smoke hole cave. No way this is the entrance. Where's the key door? No! I don't understand where the inner door is. We've seen it all? Really? Aw, oh, man. Is that something? I don't know. Really? There's no inner door key at all? <clears throat> Ow. Alright, quick double check. I just, I can't believe it. There's no inner door something or other for this key? Really? Nothing. Just, just, just no door. Oh, Brother Martin. I guess he never jumped down. <laughs> True. Nothing, nothing, nothing. I'm not seeing anything. Uh. I just, I can't believe this. This is so wild to me. No, not here. Huh. This is so crazy. There's nothing. Uh. Uh. 
Sorry, I was checking time real life. No, nothing. Absolutely jack. <sighs> okay. Alright. I suppose then that we are done. I, I, I can't think of anything else to do, so we're just gonna go. Maybe it was for a door I already unlocked. Maybe it was for the average chest in the back. Who knows? But I'm not going to spend here wasting all of our time looking for a door that doesn't even show up on the local map. So, yeah. Moving on. Oh, no. That. There you go. Moving on. Good stuff. We're still skilling up. We got a, like a little village thing almost to go explore after this. Interested to see what that is. Last time we went to one of those little village things, it was Hacter, which I'm pretty sure was full of cannibals. And that was pretty wild. So, who knows? These villages can actually be pretty uh, entertaining and interesting from what I've seen. I was so not ready for Hacter to be all that, by the way. Ooh, it's getting late, is it? Oh god, it's 11 o'clock. Well, maybe we can... Uh, Rent an inn here or something. Get some good sleep. Loading area. I still think it's funny that it even says that. Uh, oh, it's just a farm. Guiden Farm. Hmm. Oh, wow. There's Anvil. Found it. Guiden Farm. Doors locked. No one seems to be home. Well, that's ominous. The way I got a message telling me that is pretty crazy. That's out of the norm. Looks like we have a keep on the way to Anvil before we make it to Anvil proper. And then after this keep, we'll probably be there. Looking forward to that. New location. New city. That's cool. Alright, Anvil. I'm ready for you. Two arms? I heard you. Oh! This guy came out of nowhere. Heavy armor skill increased. Ooh, a healing bandit. Look at you. Ow. Listen, I've started training my skills a lot less since you started helping, Martin. So you're kind of a double-edged sword here. But I do appreciate the help. Do I appreciate it enough that I don't find it... That I would rather be alone? It's debatable. So, until we reach Wayne and Pri Priory, I guess I'm just gonna <laughs> put up with you being here. Okay. Bandits. Makes sense so close to the city. Since the guards don't seem to ever want to deal with anything directly outside city walls. They only want to deal with what's in the city walls. Oh, Jesus. A marauder. <laughs> <laughs> I think Brother Martin's spells hurt. Just a suspicion based on how it's dropping people. Yeah, we're just starting to find marauders that are just wearing steel just cuz, though. Maybe we can find some dwarven gauntlets. How dope would that be? Because the gauntlets are the big thing for me, because that's what we look at while we're using our hand-to-hand. -hand. Oh! I didn't, I didn't even see that trap. I'm going to be honest. Okay. Ah, busted. Oh. I missed. Boom! Whoa, what the? I lost her completely. Marauder Archer, down she goes. Oh my god, Brother Martin. <laughs> Chill, boy. <laughs> they don't need to know you're that much of a badass. <laughs> Holy shit. I think he's better than me in a fight. Nah, I think I could take him. Yeah, just because we have so much health, we can take him. But, I mean, at strictly dealing damage, he's definitely better than us. Uh, we'll, I was going to say, let's check the damage. But, we'll, like I said, we'll check that when we get to a city. That's when we'll check our skill and all that. Oh, I didn't see his mud crab. They're always so sneaky. Sneaky beaky, these, cra these mud crabs. I don't know how they survive with these other marauders in here, but, you know. Ah, damn it, I... 
I was ah. Hate to see it. Hate to see it. Bronze necklace, intelligence, gold. Okay. Let's do the old faithful repair hammers. Armor skill increase. It <laughs> didn't, didn't lower how much weight we had, but it did something. Hmm. Okay. We're just about an anvil. I could have just used ease burden instead, but ah oh well. Okay, so that's deeper in. Uh, is there another side? There is another side. Let's just go in, though. Fort Strand Great Dome. It's kind of cool sounding. I bet we find a warlord of sorts. Just a suspicion. Foul tidings in Skyrim. Martin, don't trigger that Hello? trap. Martin, God damn it, Martin. Everyone's saying there's trouble in Kavach. The whole town destroyed. Only a few survivors. Damn. What a shame. Hello? Indeed. I see that dwarven right there. They say that when you murder. Two of you. supposed to be impressed. Ah, get back here. So, y'all be the contemptible? Oh, really? We got like a whole, we got a whole dude right here. With a magic weapon, it looks like. That's really lighting me up. Oh my god. Holy shit. <laughs> no, sir. That's not okay. We just took so much damage from that weapon. Uh, let's be honest. Let's use two more. This this fight's not looking like it's gonna be done super soon. There we go. One down. Ah, nice. Got the stagger. Ah. There we go. Got the warlord. We won't die because it's not our time, baby. Not our time. You're trapped in here with us. Get wrecked. Get ah. Oh my god. Wow. What was that weapon? Dwarven Curse, Dwarven Greaves, right, right, right. Steel boots. Rock Shatter. 51 more uses. Shock damage, 8. It's a Dwarven Mace. Weakness to shock. Oh my god, he's got the full Dwarven set. And this. Rock Shatter is weightless. Is that for a quest? Whoa. Whoa. I've come across an unusual mace named Rock Shatter on the body of a Nord. The mace has a worn inscription on the half reading, To Maeva and Bjalfi in honor of your union. I should hang on to this weapon, as I'm sure Maeva will want to know her late husband's fate. Huh. I mean, if it's weightless. Gauntlets and boots! Time to swap out some equipment! We were just talking about this. Boots and... Oh, wait. No, we can't do the boots. The boots are the reason we can carry so much. Wait, hold up, just kidding! Where, where, are the, where are the boots? Oh no! Gauntlet stuff. Boom! Where are the... Oh shoot, where are the feathered boots? Are you kidding me? There you are. Okay. Woo. New gauntlets though. Oh, look at those! Those look mean! I'm all about it. Steel gauntlets, gone. Oh boy, that's uh. Now what? We don't need dwarven boots. Uh, okay. And then ease burden. There you go. Alteration increased. We need to be careful of leveling up soon. Damn, Martin, we are getting uh. It's been a little rough. I don't even remember that fight was so traumatic. I don't even remember how I got here. <laughs> what ways I've been. Okay. Alright. Holy shit. We're gonna be looking at these dwarven gauntlets for a while, probably, so I hope you like the way they look. 
Because this is basically our new look for a while. Oh, shit. Hold up. Not that way yet. We gotta explore this middle area first. We're almost to Anvil. Very close. Okay. Alright. I feel like we're sneaking pretty quick. Does this go? This does go somewhere. Okay, gate. I better oh. cut down on the ale. Starting to see things. Messed up. Come on. There we go. All right. Whew. Oh, he's on the other side of the uh, bridge. Gotcha. And the other side, that's how we got here. Okay. All right. All right. So we didn't go this way. This way? This way. There was a that way, and I messed up. Damn it. <laughs> Damn it. I'm such an idiot. Who watches this shit? Ah. Ah. Athletic skill increased. Oh, good. Okay. This this time. Is it? Is it? Do I have to go this way? Maybe. This way. I went the other way last time. Right? Or did I go the other way? Well, this doesn't help. That's how we got here. Oh, you're right. We fell. We fell off the bridge. That's how we got here. That whole fight was like so like... <laughs> it threw me for such a loop that I got completely thrown around in my head. I usually have great direction sense, but that <laughs> fall absolutely killed me. And all of my direction sense. Okay. Sorry. This way. Moving on. Right. Anything in here? There's anything over here. Ooh, sh loot. Give me that good stuff. 13 gold. 15 gold. And, and that's it. This, that was the room. Glad we came back for that. That 28 gold might matter. We'll see. Now let's head back. Uh, yeah, we went there. We went there. Under? Nope, not under. I have to go around. Okay. Alright, we have not gone left and then left. This is new. Yeah. Alright. Duke's up. Ready for more. Come on, then. Oh, hello. A marauder. Hey. Got him. Dummy. Was it going to let me talk to him? Was I the dummy for not talking to him? I'm so confused. Ooh, easy. Nice. Nice. Okay, let's do three more heals and then save our... Magicka for ease burden again, just in case. Brother Martin, watch that. <sighs> Brother Martin, I swear. <sighs> Alright, renew the ease burden. Is this the, uh. Yeah, that's the Great Dome. We've already been there. We have not been here, though. What is all this? Uh, it's just a pit. Should I should I be going down here? Is this okay? Oh my god! Wait a second, that goes so far. What? Oh god! There's a chest down there too. I guess I'm going down. Am I going down? No, surely not. Surely that's a trap. That's meant to kill us, right? No. Yes? Yeah, there's no. There's no way we're going down there. I don't care if there is a chest down there. That's not happening. Oh, I don't like this at all. Oh my god. Oh my god. Ah! Holy shit. When, I, when you only get one life, those are sometimes the scariest moments in the whole game. Okay, this is the way down to the chest. 
Gotcha. Okay. God, that was scary. Wait. No, yeah, I haven't been here. This was looking familiar for a second. Uh oh. Guess it was nothing. Guess it was nothing. Oh god, this is dangerous. What the hell? Oh god. Must have been the wind. Must have been the wind. Had to be. God. Okay. All right. Here we go. Why are you down here, you crazy lady? You crazy lady. You crazy lady. Brother Martin, don't hit me. Holy shit. <laughs> Those chests were not worth the danger I put myself in. Are you kidding me? Oh no! If we fall, getting back up here, I gotta take this. I gotta take my time on this. If I fall on this part right here, and that's how our run ends, I'm gonna be so disappointed in myself. Okay. All right, so we've gone everywhere in this direction now. Excellent, excellent. Okay. Let's just jump that. We don't need that. Okay, good. We got some hops in this bitch. All right, we've been there. That should be most of the fort. Oh, swing, bada bada, swing, swing, bada bada, swing, bada bada, swing. Hey. One of my favorites. Okay. Keep healing up here. Old wooden door again. Wait, we already opened this last time. Why did that close again? That's weird. Alright, we have been everywhere. We did it. Great dome, great dome. Yeah, alright. Time to go to Anvil. We got a city to visit. And uh, it's 5 in the morning, I realize. We should have slept while we were in there. But that's okay. We'll find somewhere to sleep in Anvil, I'm sure. It's going to be a late night, but we're going to make it. Loading area. Cool. So yeah, this is going to be our plan next time. Next time we get on, we are going to explore Anvil. Hopefully we can fit its entirety in one part, but we'll see just how big this city is. It's looking pretty big. We'll have to find out. So thank you so much for being here with me and Xander. If you liked the video, consider giving it a like. If you really enjoyed it, consider subscribing. If not, no hard feelings. And I will see all of you next time.